Hey, Tom with Hot Bug Grid. Nigga, fuck your life. Now, he told me I should address some things, uh, what transpired after I released the hate time, the last episode about the Joker, where I say he's a bitch for dissing Hobson and Tech 9 once again. And everybody hit me up and called me an idiot and said it wasn't a diss, so I owe him an apology. So I'll go ahead and give him that right now. That's right, bitches. I give no apologies. I told you in that video, I give no apologies. First and foremost, motherfuckers, that shit only reiterated how much he is a bitch. Because when I seen that shit, he needed to apologize to me. He wasted valuable time in my life. It took me back to the 80s watching after school specials. This nigga talking about I'm sorry and shit, acting like a bitch, singing and dancing and shit. That shit is garbage. That nigga's a fucking idiot. That nigga's an idiot. I'm not an idiot for calling him a bitch. I just spoke my opinion. That nigga would have been a bitch whether he dissed, and he's a bitch because he apologized. He's a bitch. Get over it. You motherfuckers nut hugging, taking up for this motherfucker, hitting up the inboxes for this motherfucker like he kicking you down a check to swing from his nutsack. You guys are better than my bottom bitches. I got bitches that want to take up for me like that. And I'm a fucking pimp. I got bitches that want to even take up for me like that. Y'all niggas, what are y'all getting from this nigga? Dude, seriously, when, when you see a video with somebody talking shit about your favorite artist, what are you getting out of the situation by commenting and replying to them motherfuckers? What are you like, uh, the Joker's secret service agents? Are you taking a bullet for the Joker? What are you related in some financial standing with the Joker? Where if somebody demeans him in any way, you have to step in? Did the Joker hit you up on Facebook and tell you to take her as lightweight? It was very, very heartfelt. I, I definitely, I definitely concur that it was heartfelt. What actually happened when I seen the video is I almost picked up the phone and called the mad rapper and told him I was sorry. But then once I dialed the number and he answered, I called him a fat fuck again because I don't apologize, nigga. I don't apologize.